So I'm connecting uh, Jake Gyllenhaal to Ryan Reynolds. And I'm connecting uh, Orlando Bloom to Johnny Depp. I'm also connecting Sandra Bullock to Anna Hathaway and uh, Hillary Clinton to Meryl Streep, but that I have told about earlier. And I can legit be looking at Anna Hathaway thinking that it is Sandra Bullock, or I can be looking at Hillary Clinton thinking that it is Meryl Streep. I can also be looking at uh, Jake uh, Gyllenhaal thinking that it is Ryan Reynolds, or I can be looking at... Uh, Johnny Depp thinking that it is Orlando Bloom. Probably also the other way around, but I do not think that I've been looking at Meryl Streep thinking that it is Hillary Clinton. Has it happened lately? Probably not, because I have been studying celebrities and uh, the family network within uh, the celebrities. So why does this happen? I book people into groups based on their appearance, based on their vibe based on uh, their behavior or based on the media presentation. And a vibe can, for instance, be a tone of voice, because that is not something which is connected to the appearance, but uh, still uh, that could be an indication of a family connection. I connected Jake Gyllenhaal and Ryan Reynolds in uh, Orlando Bloom and uh, Johnny Depp very closely together. But uh, anyhow, they do not look that fucking similar, but uh, somehow I am so very aware of the fact that they should kind of be connected together. Am I right? Am I wrong? I don't know. But somehow I'm very sure about the fact that they should be connected together. So maybe I am unconsciously picking up the fact that they are looking very similar without being consciously aware of why. And actually there is a twin height in between uh, Orlando Bloom and uh, Johnny Depp, so... It could be that I'm picking up something with their appearance, yes. A twin height is the height difference uh, between twins, which is sometimes assumed to be 2 centimeters. It doesn't necessarily mean that they are twins, but... Uh, that there is somewhere in their family is uh, twins, uh, which is uh, the reason for this uh, centimeter deviation to appear in the first place. Orlando Bloom is 180, while Johnny Depp is uh, 178 centimeters, which is assumed to be the height of Elvis Presley. Orlando Bloom is 45 years of age, while Johnny Depp is 59, so they cannot be twins. But based on the fact that there is a 2 cm difference in between them, and I am connecting them together, they are probably in biological family. Jake Gyllenhaal has the height of 182 centimeters, which is the height of my non-biological brother, while Ryan Reynolds has the height of 188 centimeters, which is the height of the mother to my biological half-brothers. And I have earlier been talking about how my non-biological uncle Per has uh, told my brother that he looks like... Uh, Jim Carrey, and uh, Jim Carrey is 188 centimeters, so even though my non-biological brother does not actually look like him, uh, that is connecting uh, my non-biological brother of uh, 182 centimeters to the height 188 centimeters. Because it is likely that my non-biological uncle Pierre is saying this because he knows that my 
non-biological, rather is in a biological family with Jim Carrey. Jake Gyllenhaal is 41 years old, while Ryan Reynolds is 45 years old. And I'm not very occupied with what kind of diseases my body has, but uh, something which I recognize is that uh, Ryan Reynolds, which is in biological family with my biological half-brothers, uh, he has the name of my disease, which is Reynolds disease. So, <laughs> what's up with that? And because I'm not actually very occupied by this disease, I didn't know that it was written kind of very different. But it is worth to notice and consider because some of the names of these celebrities are very popular. So, since it seemed to be the case that these people actually are in biological family, it could be that I'm unconsciously picking up something about their appearance, which is connecting them closer together than what I am capable of doing consciously. And then I'm talking about Jake Gyllenhaal and Ryan Reynolds and uh, Willanda Bloom and uh, Johnny Depp, not uh, Jim Carrey. And another thing, uh, Jake Gyllenhaal kind of looks like uh, Ryan Gosling and based on their age, they could be actual twins and there is a 2 centimeter deviation in between them. Even though twins should be born on the same day, my impression is that it is not so difficult to hide a person for one month if you are in control over the media. And Ryan Gosling has the same name as Ryan Reynolds, which uh, probably are in the same biological family. Because it is a common thing that uh, biological family name themselves based on other biological family members. The actual name of uh, Jake Gyllenhaal is uh, Jacob uh, Benjamin Gyllenhaal. Their eye, eye area looks kind of uh, similar, their eye color looks similar, their nose looks kind of similar, their mouth looks kind of similar, their eyebrows is uh, shaped kind of uh, similar.